Hey guys, <laughs> it is time for me to set up my bookshelf, so I'm going to do a hyperlapse, I guess, using my phone to set up my books. This is definitely going to help decrease the amount of boxes that we have still have sitting around the apartment. I gave a bookshelf tour, which I'll link right here, before we moved, and the shelf's going to go up pretty much in the same way, but uh, I thought I would give you a timestamp so you can see how long it takes me. It is currently 12.12 12 a.m. on the 25th of August. I think I have eight boxes of books that I need to sort through and put up. You're going to be seeing a lot of my butt. I know. I'm thick. So if you guys like seeing this kind of thing, you know, my real life and not just makeup, please subscribe to my channel. Give us a like and uh, watch me set up my most prized possession.
so I got pretty much everything set up for my book collection. I'm still missing a few books that may have been put into random boxes right at the end of our packing. It is now 11.12. Exactly on the dot. It took me an hour to put all of my books up and organize them in the way that I wanted. It might change a bit. I'll take you over there. This is almost exactly the same as it was before we moved. Like, basically, um, on the dot. At least the first four shelves are all exactly the same. I had all of my classic literature over here, but then I didn't want to hide all of the good classic literature that I liked down on the bottom shelf. So I put those up here. Whoops, one more. In our old bedroom, we had this long table that had a shelf underneath that I put a bunch of my like a random assortment of books, things that I had taken from my mom's old classroom and uh, things that I had read when I was young and was, you know, wanting to read again. But that is now next to our front door and has other things on that shelf like scrapbooks and I don't know, other stuff. So I pulled in one of these long shelves, these long skinny shelves that uh, used to hold our DVD collection. But now two of our other bigger bookshelves are holding the DVD and uh, our game collection. So the classics that I love are here. These are some books I read in like elementary school. This was the first book that I ever cried over. Already this is starting to feel more like an office, like home, like a library. I kind of realized that halfway through. I've always wanted a library. And so this is now kind of like my study, my den, with all of my books in it. I love it. I love it. I'm not sure if this shelf is going to stay here because it's right in front of a light switch. But I liked it there. I'm probably going to put another one of these over on that side. Over here. But for now, I'm going to end. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed seeing this video and my time lapse of setting up my bookshelf, my most prized possession, give us a thumbs up. And let me know if you ever wanted a library when you were younger or now, or if you have a library. I want to know all about it. Book lovers unite. I hope you guys have a good one. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!